Hey guys, if you're into real estate investing, REIlytics is a platform that you need to be a part of. It's really, really cool. The whole idea of it is basically helps you find what areas to invest in the US based on your criteria. So what I'm gonna to do today is give you a quick overview of what it is, and hopefully you'll, you'll find it helpful. So once you sign up, you can go to, um, by the way, it's actually, they've got a free early access at the moment. So you can go to REILytics.com and sign up for the free early access. Uh, once you log in, you can go to the dashboard and you're presented with a ton of options. So you can basically look at all the different metro areas by market appreciation. So if you're looking to really grow your equity and the value of your property, you click on market appreciation. Likewise, if you're really looking for cash flow and you want to increase your rental growth, you can kind of look at it that way. Alternatively, you can let it find a specific region for you. So um, it basically asks you a few questions and it'll guide you through the process and you can kind of like answer the questions like what your budget is and then it'll spit out um, a bunch of uh, areas that it rec recommends based on your criteria. Or if you wanna look at a specific um, area, you can, you can do that as well. Um, for now, I just wanna give you a quick, quick overview of it. The main, main menu over here, you've got mortgage rates, which it actually shows what the mortgage rates are, which is pretty cool on average. It's got a rental calculator as well, so you can help identify cash flow for specific properties that you're looking at. Resources, which is really cool too if you're new to um, real estate investing, a uh, really good way to uh, educate yourself and learn more, and then places that you add in your favorites. So let's look at going back to the main overview. Let's say, for example, you wanna look at market appreciation. You can easily look at this through a um, bird's eye view of the US. So you can have a look at what the appreciation is. You can sort it by different states, and then you can look at what the average appreciation is across um, a period of time or for a span of um, four, four years. So 2018 to present, almost five years now. Um, and then you can look at what the average price of a property is, what the estimated like approximate tax rate is for the given state and the population. So let's say for example, we're looking at, oh, let's say um, El Paso, Texas. You can go in here, you can click on it, you can look at what the average rental growth is, you can look at what the average appreciation is, and you can play around with it. You can look at how it's grown over the last uh, five years, and then you could look at what the for sale inventory is, medium days depending, price cut. Um, yeah, there's a lot of information on what the rent is. You can see that it's like rapidly gone up, and then it dropped down a little bit. Um, in October of 22, and then it starts to pick up again. So it's a really, really cool tool to help you um, really identify locations. You can even look at the economics, so what the unemployment rate is, what the sectors are, and then you could also look at the demographics as well. So you can have a look at the population. Here it looks like it's been kind of steady, uh, and then you could look at population by age. I mean, there's a whole lot of um, information here that you could use to help you really identify where it makes sense for you to invest in real estate. And then you can make notes specifically for um, the area as well. I haven't had a chance to fully play with it, but it looks really, really exciting and promising. So um, yeah, you can go around and play with it. Then you've got the rental growth, same thing here. Let's say we wanna look at Atlanta. You can have a look at Atlanta and you can kind of see how it's um, growing and um, what the rentals are. So steady incline. Anyway, I hope that was helpful. You can access it, www.reilytics.com.